these two <coughs> swings now are pretty much synced up together. So the clubs now, I'm going to play this one, the one that felt to you about 50% speed that was just working on the movement, yeah. okay? This is the one you were trying to clubber it as hard as you could, old movement, okay? Look at the two swings there in terms of sync. They're almost the same, aren't they? There's nothing really that different. Yeah. What feels to you really slow is still quick, but it's smoother, you see, because the arms and body are working together. Not if it was 50% speed, it should take twice the time, shouldn't it? In theory, yeah. So, in terms of that movement where you were before, we were getting a lot of leg action going back, a very unstable base. You compare that now to this one here in the top of the back swing, a bit more solid, yeah, yeah, a lot more solid base there. We can stand there, that looks like you're under control a little bit further. That left foot lifting a little bit, that's absolutely fine. We're not losing distance in terms of the club going back because we're just making a still the good shoulder turn and turn the body. But the lower half now is supporting the top half. So when you come back down, rather than waiting for your left foot to get flat here and then go, oh, I'll move to the left-hand side now, and being a bit late, we're able to move now to the left-hand side from here, you see. So we can shift that way, that right foot starting to move off the ground and releasing through up onto that left side. So when you finish, the majority of your weight now is going to be full. At the moment, you're probably about 75% of where you need to get to, okay? okay? And so is that right foot. And so is that right hip in time. That will be up on its toe fully. That right hip will be level. So your sort of belt buck will be out of view. And you'll be up against that green line. But that's the progression to, from yep. there to there to there, sort of down the line. Yep. But in terms of the change there, as we said, ball position with the driver. Forward of your stance because on the tee peg. You want to strike the ball on the way up. And then the movement now in terms of your back. So this is for all club. Whether it's 7 iron, 5 iron driver is maintaining a nice stable base around it. So we can now swing from here. We can move to the left, get your body shifting to the left side, getting in a good position. Again, when you did that, it felt a lot smoother because arms and body are working together. It's all nice and sort of synced together rather than the arms and body working against each other. Yeah. So smooth, we associate it being slow. In reality, it's not any slower because the ball's still going 200 yards. Yeah. It just feels slow. Okay. And it does. Yeah, and effortless. It's loose, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Okay, makes sense, mate, yeah? It does. Good, have a couple more in the basket, mate, and then we'll uh, wrap things up.